Hi, I'm Lori Michael, Lori Michael Fitness, specializing in senior fitness in the home and on Zoom. With the help of my friend Kim, we're going to be working on the backs of the arms, also known as the triceps. So not only does it add exercises add some definition, but functionally it helps us turn in bed, get out of a chair, um, get off from the floor, um, and a few other things. But we're going to get started with some bands again. Okay, so the last time we met, we used a band in an exercise where we're pressing outward. So Lori, let's go back to that. Bring your hands up to your shoulders, and you're just gonna press outward. We're gonna progress this exercise to get a little bit more out of the triceps. So you're in your initial position, bend one elbow, lowering the elbow, and then press away, and then we reverse the arm, we switch the arms. The upper arm is coming into the ribs and pressing straight away. So not only are we getting the shoulder, we're also getting the tricep here. Couple more, bend, extend. If you find it's a little too hard, you start the hands a little wider. If it was a little too easy, then you'd walk the hands in a little bit. So it's real easy to adjust your resistance when you're using a band. Okay, here's another one with the same band. You're gonna hold your hand at either shoulder, hold one hand to your shoulder. The other hand comes in a little bit closer on the band, so it's not too much room, good, perfect. And then you're gonna bring the arm up, hand up to your shoulder, and you're gonna angle the arm upward towards the ceiling and back down. On this one, we emphasize one arm only and then we'll switch. So let's switch to the other side and press upward. So this one we're not alternating. This one we do one arm. Again, we're getting the back of the arm and the shoulder. Okay, here's an exercise you can do with weights. We're gonna do a tricep kickback. You're gonna put your hand on something that's gonna help stabilize your back and give a little support to your back. Lori's hinging at the hip, knee slightly bent, so she's leaning into gravity, her arm with the weight. The upper arm, you can see it's horizontal, it's parallel to the floor. She's gonna straighten the elbow, and then slowly bend, and not bend the elbow very much, straighten. And then a very small bend, so she's really not bringing the arm forward from the hip. It's coming right to the side of the hip, and then up behind. Here's a way that people do it incorrectly. They go faster and they do way too much range of motion. Just using momentum, bringing the hand to the shoulder and back. You'll never feel the tricep that way. So let's show them correct one more time, Lori. Straighten and then just bend a few degrees. Straighten, it's slower and it's much more controlled. Very nice. So depending upon how strong you are, if you're just getting started, you want to use a lighter weight. I happen to have been doing the exercise with an eight pound weight. I'm used to doing it. But um, just make sure that you're doing it correctly. And, and when you are in that position where you're leaning over, protect your back by pulling in your tummy just a little bit and you'll be good. And as far as the repetition goes, I would say try to do two sets of at least 10 on each arm, okay? See you next time. Thanks.